doing the cabin air filter on a Toyota 4Runner that this will cover Tacomas, Tundras, your FJ Cruisers and this is something you don't want to see. There was a rodent living up in there, created a nest and now I got to deal with it. Got to get a vacuum, clean all that off but you can see all the turds right there. The nest is back there truly truly nasty and let's see it was done in 2018 it is now april of 2021 customer was complaining that it smelled disgusting when she turned on the air and now i know why so check your air filter cabin air filters on a regular basis don't let this happen that is truly nasty just a public service announcement from Bundy's Garage. This is what I pulled out of the blower motor. You can see it's a whole rat's nest. Pretty deep box. And that is the cabin air filter. And I'm assuming that's urine. It's either rat or mouse urine. Very gross. Very disgusting. So don't let your uh, cabin air filter end up looking like this. Change your cabin air filter. And uh, the crappy part is, when I pulled all this out, there's debris that fell down into the blower motor. The actual spinning part of the motor. And uh, it's been a bear trying to get that out. I'm trying to get the vacuum down there to suck it out. But looks like I might have to just go in there and use my hand to get it out. Uh, it, smells like, uh, it smells like ammonia basically coming through your vents if you smell this. I know there's other um, threads out there. Uh, that talk about ammonia smell when you have the rear window down on a 4Runner but uh, this actually comes from the vents so just uh, be mindful of that as well okay hopefully this is the last of it but I had to end up taking out the blower motor only three little bolts hold it in three little eight millimeter little screws actually hold it in but uh, you can see all the seeds and crap down there and I didn't want to get into the system so I just decided to pull it out not hard one little connector Holds it on, and you have to take a little bottom cover off, but it's not bad at all. So, just took it out, gonna clean all that off, spray it off with air, get it all cleaned up. We'll be ready to rock and roll. Alright guys, there you go. If this has helped you out, please consider subscribing to Buddy's Garage, and like always, I'll keep them rolling for you.